Lawrence. Prince Lawrence. This is one of the more key decisions, like, um... The other ones speak genuinely just affect how people like you, but this is like one of the massive ones that will affect the story. I'm gonna go to Lawrence's apartment. You think he did it? What's her husband's name? Oh, we Bullshit. need to tell him about his wife. He deserves to know. You're right. And Toad's a tough toad. He can probably handle himself for a few hours. He's a cockney bruiser. <laughs> Bullfin Street. I don't know what happened to Prince Lawrence. Lawrence's apartment, South Bronx, early morning. I thought I said, oh, early morning then. I thought it was a damn long time together. Then it was dark when we left. I don't want to stay here any longer than we have to, so let's just pick an approach and stick to it, okay? Let's kick the door down, scream, she just dead, and then leave. Me. Uh, we... When the magic mirror showed me this apartment, I think I saw a knife inside, covered in what looked like blood. I wasn't expecting that. <laughs> well... Like I said, let's not overcomplicate things. You can question him while I look around for it. And if he objects, we are here on official more. Fable Town business, and we can be persuasive if necessary, or you can. Explosive with my muscle. Persuasive with my muscle, I man. What the hell did I say? Dissuasive. You know, Jesus Christ, the controllers, goddamn. Might use a controller. I'm using a mouse and keyboard. It probably would be easier with a controller. Should I just open the door? Yeah, let's just open the door. Lawrence, you in there? This door is about to get kicked the fuck down. All right, let's kick it. Hey, open up. It's Bigby. I need to talk to you. Just go through the window and it be easier. Is there a back door or something? Uh, let's see this. Do we walk around or what? Um, okay, let's follow snow. I don't know where she... Why the hell does that keep going to the left? Oh, the window. Let's go through the window then. Looks like anyone could just climb in there from the street. Talk to the window, fair enough. Hey! Hey! That looks uh, a bit uh, gruesome, doesn't it? Let's climb in. Oh, it's the police as well, fair enough. Alright, we'll try this out. Guess we're out of options. <laughs> Come on, help me up. I guess he's probably been dead for a while. Holy shit. Did he shoot himself in the heart? Oh, God. Two people's dead. We need to figure out what the hell is going on here. Who would do this to them? I don't know, Snow. Hmm. I wonder if coming here first actually made any difference to the story or whatever. I don't know. Uh, let's have a look at the. Oh, what's this? No, let's have a look at the sword, the knife, or whatever the hell. Sharp. There's blood on the blade. Is that the same knife you saw in the mirror? Yeah. Why are you just cut things? It looks like I don't he. Know why it's over here? I just don't understand. Why would someone want to kill him? What did they use the knife for, though? Because it looks like it's a bullet wound in him, not a knife wound. That's him. It looks kind of like his wrist or something have been cut, though, doesn't it? Around his ends. It looks a bit bloody. Oh yeah, let's invest. Should we touch his wrist? Yeah, it's, it's definitely been slit. Should I touch it? It's pretty gross. Dry. Why is his blood? No. Is that that's a bullet hole? Yeah. That left a mark. Ruined his shirt. <laughs> Fair enough. So his wrist was cut and his heart was shot. It's pretty fucked up. Do they? I wouldn't know. What's he, what's he been taking here? What's he doing? What are they? Pills. Prescription sleeping pills. Maybe he OD'd. Alright, what else have we got? What's that? A gun. What sort of gun is that? <laughs> is that a Glock? What is it? This gun wasn't fired recently. Maybe a week ago. Or more. I can smell a gunpowder in the air. Let's pick up the gun. It's my gun. 
I need to defend myself. Definitely one case on the floor, though. They'll be on the grip and the trigger. <laughs> Didn't even go fuck, does he? Let's look at the shell gaze in. So this is the bullet that killed him. Maybe. Could be. Matches the caliber of the gun on the floor. Seems to know a lot about guns for a wolf. So all is all we can look at again is back. Back out of the all right, what else have we got around here? I've already invented Ooh. Oh. Use gun with no, I'm gonna look at that first. I don't really want to shoot the hot wall yet. Bullet passed through the chair. It's a bit high, isn't it? Actually, I guess it depends what angle. Let's use the gun with it. Snow, could you uh, stand over there? Point the towards Lawrence, it? as if you're the shooter. Yeah, I was gonna say that would have. This is feels strange. Yeah, it's a bit tight. It's way too high, isn't it? He would have to be like below, unless he shot himself. What and, are like... you thinking? The slug should have gone over there, right behind him, not here. Right. So the shooter stood somewhere else. Maybe he shot himself. Maybe, or we don't have the whole story. Yeah, because if he held the gun himself, like shot it at himself, he'd kind of be pointing it up, wouldn't he? And it kind of go like, Doosh. I don't know though. So there's a picture of Why Faith and him in the good old days. Before all this. Fair enough. Pretty obvious. Goes without saying, doesn't it? So what's up with the blood, Big B? Is it a good sort of blood? What sort of blood is it? Still a little sticky. Is it his blood? Or is it the Pip's blood? Oh, got suspicious. Look at that. Look at it hanging out. That's a bed, isn't it? It's one of those cupboard beds. So I'm looking there. It's totally gonna fall on me, isn't it? What's that? It's a note. Son of a... My dear Faith. Is that a suicide note? There's blood on her as well. Stuck to the bed a little. My dearest Faith, I never meant to hurt you. And I cannot endure knowing that I have. This was for the best. I'll see you again. Love your devoted Lawrence. Oh, he's a sweetheart, isn't he? Fair play. Was it suicide? I should know his face. There are so few of us. I should know his face. Sound like a suicide note to me. <laughs> Holy shit! What the? Oh my God, Rigby, he's alive. What? What are you doing here? Let's get you back up. Oh, what are you doing here? Uh, I have What's some questions on? for you. We found you here in your chair with what we thought was a fatal injury. We should call Swinehart. Have him take a look at you. Wait a second on that snow. You know who I am? Yes. Good. I have a few questions. Uh, when was the last time you saw it? We found your What's suicide note. What happened? What happened? I don't know. I. Oh, shit. Why are the subtitles going really slow? It's like left or right shot myself in the heart. Oh, I thought I'd be dead by now. See, I knew he shot himself. It hurts like fucking hell. Your heart's actually a little more to the center. Probably had a lot. <laughs> Great. Why would you shoot yourself there? Oh, shit. At least that's how I think it happened. I suppose he probably would have survived a shot to the head, Things like a little fuzzy. the woodsman took an axe to the head and he seemed pretty fucking dandy. Bad dream. What happened? Why did you do it, Lawrence? I did it because I was ashamed. I, I couldn't live with myself, knowing I had done that to her. I did what I could to keep her away, but she still worries about me. She comes by, makes sure I'm okay. Don't know if I have the heart to tell him she's dead, to be honest. I'm a fucking burden. I'm useless. I don't want her to have to worry about me anymore. She's better off without me, without me being here to drag her down. She deserves that. She's been through a lot. If I tell him she's dead, better by her. he'll pretty much just she's finish him off. Me. Uh, just I'm gonna go see a half truth. Away. I don't really want to lie to him entirely because I don't think missing. I don't think Why? Snow will like that. Oh no, no, 
No. No. No, no, no. I knew this would happen. I think Snow would appreciate a lie, so I'm kind of going in the middle. Georgie. Georgie, eh? Is that a name, my here? Who is Georgie? Did you kill your wife? You need to pull it together and say, Lawrence. Oh my god. Is it a pip? Do you? Maybe it's a police. Kind of does smell danky in you. Oh god damn. No, wait. Preparing for a fight, yeah. They're coming in anyway, fair enough. We need to know why whoever's out there is breaking in. I need your help. What do I do? Just play dead. What? Trust me. You can't move in your condition anyway, so just stay still. The second we figure out what they're here for, Bigby will arrest them. Think about your wife. Give me back the gun, just in case. That's a good idea. Give him a gun. Right, this better work. He better play the role and play damn good. I want to get some arrests in. Do, do we have to, like... Do we control when we jump out? Because I don't want to have to jump out too early or something and fuck everything up. Holy shit. Oh, okay, yeah, we do. Okay, it's not. Oh, it's Tweedledee. Or is that Tweedledum? I don't know, it's one of the Tweedles. Look at him, he's a bit ugly, isn't he? Look at him with his fedora. I got my eye on him. I'm going to hover the mouse over the jump out button. Why can I jump out on him? Why do we have two options to jump out? Let's look at the intruder. Crap. I don't know who that is. It's one of the Tweedles. I know who it is. Is he literally just walking around? I thought we have to wait for something to happen. What's he doing? He looks mafia-esque, doesn't he? He looks like he's in the mob. Oh. I'm going to jump out before he gets a chance to jump out on me. Whoa, whoa, no, no, no. Jump, 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 stop. <laughs> He's gonna shoot at him. Hey. He's gonna shoot. He's a suspect. I can't allow him to kill him. Why would you leave Prince Lawrence? Snow should have stayed there. Hey, I, don't, I, I hope that was the right decision there because um, he was aiming a gun. Alone. Shit. He was aiming a gun at him, so I didn't want him to kill a potential suspect. I don't know if he would have, but uh, I don't know. Maybe he would have ended up killing Prince Lawrence. I don't know. Shit. I might. You fuck. I hate quick time events, goddamn. Too much effort for me. Uh, right. That looks open, I don't know. The little thing on the other door was moving, though. Shit, let's go through the window. You almost gave you the slip. Yep, I should have gone in the other one. Can he actually give me the. Holy shit, look at him. Clear with his. No good at running. He's getting away from me. Holy shit. This guy's too fast for me. So he's a, um, okay, guess we're gonna go down there then, shit, shit, I'll have him, don't worry, I'm gonna batter the shit into him, <laughs> yeah that's right, I took him out like an eagle, like a hawk, yeah he's having it isn't he, ease up Bigby, we're on the same side here, are we though, son of a bitch, <laughs> make me run after you, What are you doing back there, bub? Why were you looking through books, huh? The same thing you should be doing. Investigating. Looking for clues. The fuck you doing hiding in closets? To find out who fuck you were. Man. Fuck, man! Why did you say D at the bottom I'm then? asking the questions. You're looking for the woodsman, right? My employer is looking to ask him a few questions too. Who's your employer? Yeah, who's your employer? Who's your employer? I, mean, I can't option. tell you that. It's confidential. Sorry. Nah, he's getting a smack. Sure you understand. He is getting a smack. Can't say that I do. Come on. You're coming with me. Oh, why don't I? This could have been easy. Huh. Don't worry. It still is. Come on. Dumb. Dumb? Yeah, it is. Look, it'd be much easier for you no. to. I'm D. He's dumb. The Tweedles. I like his hat. It's a nice little hat he's got there. 
Oh well, we just got sucker punched by the You'll Tweedles. And now Snow saves the day. Where were you in the fight? Except you're lying in a dirty alley. Yep. With an open wound on the back of your head. Yep. <laughs> just leave me here. <laughs> what happened? Well, the one guy hit you, then the other one started kicking you. Explains the ribs. Then they jumped into a car and drove off. A sort of car. Come on, get up. Is it a mafia looking car? We should check in on Toad. See if there's anything there that can get us back on the trail. Or Prince Lawrence, isn't he like dead? Just forget about him. We spoke to him, just forget about him. Leave him in his chair. The Woodsman's apartment.